Leo, let me move on to Bitcoin. Ukraine becoming the latest country to legalize Bitcoin. It had a volatile week, even as El Salvador adopted the cryptocurrency as legal tender. And yet prices plunged yesterday, Leo. There's a uh, crackdown for the Securities and Exchange Commission on crypto lending uh, that's likely broader than Coinbase, according to Cowan this morning, uh, saying that Coinbase just happens to be the entity in the spotlight right now. But they're expecting the SEC to target other crypto exchanges that are offering loan products. We'll see if the regulatory environment changes as well. Well, I think I think you have to take a step back with Bitcoin and remember um, the volatility of Bitcoin over time. Um, in in 2017, 18, we saw a drop from almost 20,000 to 3,000, um, and then this meteoric rise. And along the way, we've heard all the different reasons why Bitcoin is legitimate. It's a replacement for gold, it's a storage of value, it's a currency. And uh, those continue to be debunked from time to time uh, for different reasons, mainly the pure volatility of Bitcoin. And so it's hard to really wrap your arms around why Bitcoin is going to be a currency. Um, I think when people talk with definite opinions about how great Bitcoin is, they're usually selling uh, because there is no back, there's, no, there's nothing behind this Bitcoin. And I think the perfect example of this is the morning when that's uh, the morning when it was declared a currency or a use of a currency by El Salvador? Um, several of the experts came out and said, "Hey, this is a this is a game changer. This is a replacement for fiat yeah. currencies." Well, it moved 20 percent in a day. The Mexican peso yeah. crisis was a 13 percent move, um, and th and that was a full devaluation. So. I'm not really sure why this absurdly volatile asset is a replacement as a currency. That's a, that's a, that's a stretch. Yeah, well, it uh, makes a market, that's for sure. There's uh, people on the other side of that trade who are, who are willing to take it in.